Jay's Extra. We're back on the Angors Extra pregame show. Andrew Selliver joined by Aiden Jimenez ahead of Chatham against Harwich at Veterans Field. First game after the All-Star break, and Aiden competed in the All-Star game on Saturday. Aiden, how would you sum up your experience? Uh, it was a really cool day. It was a lot of fun to get out there and compete with those guys and interact with the fans out there as well. How cool is it to get to see all of the number of players who have played well from different teams and get to play on a team with them? Uh, it was really cool. It was really fun just to see how they go about their business and see what I could take from them. What was the biggest thing you learned on Saturday? I don't know. There was a lot. Uh, just seeing how intent guys are with what they're doing each and every day and what they're doing to get ready. A number of guys in the Chatham bullpen have talked about the different stuff that's shared down there and learning about different guys, how they throw different pitches. What have been some of the things that you've shared with some of your teammates down in the bullpen? Uh, I've been trying to teach a couple of them the splitter, so just trying to help them out and help them learn that pitch. What's the biggest key to throwing it? Throw it like a fastball. <laughs> Let the grip do the work. When did you learn how to throw it? Uh, I learned this past year at school, this last half of the year, so and it's worked pretty well for me. What's the biggest thing for you when you're trying to learn a new pitch? What's the biggest thing about having comfortability implementing it in a real game? Uh, I think finding certain cues for yourself to help you get comfortable with it and know what you need to tell yourself to like make it work for you. Up here on the Cape, Chatham's catchers for the most part calling their own games along with the pitchers. What's the biggest difference in that? Uh, I would just say the biggest difference would be like having confidence in what you're throwing and knowing that you're throwing what you want to throw would be the biggest. A number of scouts at the All-Star game. Is there a lot more pressure added when you see that all the radar guns out behind home plate? Uh, I don't know. I feel like before the game, it's a little more pressure when you see them. But once you get in the game, you don't really pay attention to them. So it wasn't a big deal for me. What was the biggest moment that you'll take away and remember from the All-Star game this year? I think all the fans being there. It was really cool seeing all that many people just surrounded the whole field. And it was really cool to see. Sign a lot of autographs? Uh, yes, definitely. How much fun is it to remember how fun it is for those kids to watch all of you guys play? I think it's cool. I think every kid at some point who likes baseball always wants to get things signed by the guys. So it was cool to know that I could do that for some of those kids. What's it, is the All-Star game your favorite memory so far on Cape Cod, or do you have another one? Uh, I think that's probably the favorite so far. All right, Aiden, congratulations again on a fantastic season thus far, earning an All-Star nod, and best of luck the rest of the year. Thank you. We'll send it back to Joe for the rest of the Angler's Extra pregame show.